hi dearest traders and a warm welcome back to my channel i'm glad to see you once again in today's new video so today's video is going to be quite interesting because i'm going to be trading with the help of technical analysis and combining it with the stochastic oscillator indicator so today i'm going to be working out on situations that i'm quite familiar with and i understand very well and try and open very good trades today and make very good profit i am going to start with a small deposit of 50 four dollars and try and increase it until six thousand dollars and hopefully by the end of the video i'm able to hit my goal for today so stay tuned until the end of the video and don't forget to support the channel and the only way to do that is by liking this video sharing this video to your friends and family and subscribing down below to this channel so let me find my first entry point so as you can see here the stochastic oscillator indicator is located at the bottom of the screen it represents two slides the yellow and blue as well as the lower level of 30 and the upper level of 70 as you can see when the price in the market is actively going up on the indicator the yellow line crosses the blue line from bottom to top and both lines cross the level 30 and move to the 70 level in this situation you can open a trade on the upside furthermore when the price starts to decline the yellow line crosses the blue line from top to bottom and with both of them crossing the level 70 and moving down in this situation you can open a down trade it should also be understood that when the slides are in the upper zone i.e above the level of 70 it indicates that the money is in the overbought zone and here you can see it by the declining price highs and when the slides are in the lower zone that is below the level 30 we realize that the market is oversold therefore here you can see it by the rising price lows now i've shown you the main points of working with the stochastic oscillator indicator let me show you how it works in practice so as you can see here we have the price moving in an uptrend also on the indicator earlier the yellow line crossed the blue line from bottom to top and both of them are already crossing the 70 level in this situation i'm going to open a two minute trade as the indicator makes me realize that the price has a good upside potential also as you can see the major price lows on the chart are getting higher and i think that it's likely that the price will continue to move upwards in the uptrend in the near future also in this situation i've taken a time of two minutes with the reserve taking into account that the price may get into the haggling zone or there may be a price pull back down but as you can see now the price is already showing a good growth let me wait for the trade to close this is great friends you can see that the price continues to move up and here i got a very confident plus the indicator gave me a great entry point for the first trade and helped me make very good money at the same time i chose the right time of two minutes which was quite enough for this trade let me find my next entry point so as you can see the price made a slight downward pullback and at the moment continues to move upwards at the same time the yellow line on the indicator goes up and both of them are located in the upper zone in this situation i'm going to open a trade for two minutes on the upside here i'm going to take into account the fact that after a slight decline the slides make a rebound from the level 70 and are directed upwards again at the same time as you can see we still have enough space up to the maximum point on the chart also recently you can see the price has been moving upwards more impulsively and mostly with green candlesticks all this makes me realize that the price has a good upside potential and is likely to continue moving upwards in the uptrend and also in this situation i've used two minutes taking into account the possible trades then wait for the results this is awesome friends you can see the price continues to move up and i'm getting a very confident plus here the indicator here has once again given me a good entry point two minutes was enough time for this trade so i'm going to continue and find my next entry point here we have the price moving in an uptrend while at the moment the price is moving down also as you can see the moving indicators are crossing the 70 level with the yellow line at the bottom in such a situation i'm going to open a down trade for a minute as the indicator indicates that the price has the potential to go down and i'm thinking that the price will still show some kind of decline and only then resume its growth as you can see early the price has already made a fairly strong pullback and then continued to move upwards in the uptrend so here i can see such a decline in the price now here i also took the time of one minute take into account that this deal is not on the trend but again as the main upward price movement so that my position here is not knocked out i took one minute let me wait for the results this is awesome friends 
You can see that most of the time the price moved inexpressively, but at the last seconds an impulsive red candlestick appeared on the chart. That's my trade closes below the entry point and here I made very good profit. Let me continue and find more working situations. So here I see the price is moving in a downtrend while at the moment it is breaking through the support level with an impulse. In this situation I'm going to immediately open a downtrend for a minute because the indicator has crossed the moving lines and they come to the level 30. That is the indicator makes me realize that the price has a good potential to go down at the same time the main price highs on the chart are becoming lower and also the breakdown of the level tells me that the price will most likely to continue to move down in the downtrend in the near future also in this situation i've taken the time of one minute taking into account the impulsive price movement here also taking into account that after such an impulsive decline the price may begin to roll back up therefore one minute should be enough in this situation let me wait and see the end of this trade Oh, this is pretty good as you can see the price moves according to my scenario here and it shows a decline and here i made very good profit also one minute was enough time for this you can see the indicator did not let me down and suggested a good entry point meanwhile i've already increased the initial amount by almost 10 times which is a great result let me find my next entry point so as you can see after a little haggling under the level the price breaks through it and is now moving upwards by impulse here i'm going to immediately open a trade for a minute on the upside because on the indicator i see the yellow line is located on top and both lines move in the upper zone so here i understand that the price has the potential to rise at the same time we can see there is still enough space left from our entry point to the maximum point on the chart also as you can see recently the price has been moving more impulsively and mainly with green candlesticks so it's likely that in the near future the price will continue to move upward on the emerging upward movement and also in the situation i'm taking the time of one minute taking into account the impulsive upward movement but then we can see the results this is awesome friends you can see the price continues to move upward and i got a confident plus one minute was enough time for this trade also the indicator gave me a very good entry point let me find my next working situation here i have the price moving down at the moment and hitting the support level and i think that in the near future the price will bounce up from this level because the price has already touched it several times before and then showed a good growth at the same time i can see the stochastic slides cross and the yellow line goes up that is the indicator indicates the upcoming price growth in such a situation i'm going to open a trade for a minute on the upside because i still have a long distance to the previous price maximum this indicates that the price has a potential to rise also in this situation i use one minute because such a trade turns out to be against the main downward price movement let me wait for the results this is pretty awesome you can see the price got into the haggling zone and didn't manage to show a good growth for a minute but at the same time you see my deal closes above the entry point and i got very good profit as you can see i have my first 1000 on my balance and i'm confidently approaching my trading goal let me look at more working points so here we have a nice confident uptrend at the same time i'm observing some kind of retracement and further i can see a long green candlestick appears on the chart in this situation i'm going to open a trade for a minute on the upside because i can see that on the indicator the slides cross and the yellow line goes up also we still have enough space up to the last price high so this tells me that the price has a good upside potential at the same time the main price minimum on the chart are getting higher so it's more likely that in the near future the price will continue to move upward in the uptrend in this situation i've taken the time of one minute because recently the price is moving upwards quite impulsively so one minute will be quite enough and i'll see a good price growth and as you can see now the price is already moving above my entry point let me wait for the End of this this is excellent friends you can see the price continues to move up and i'm getting a confident plus one minute was perfect for this trade the indicator also gave me a good entry point let me see what happens in the market next so here i can see that the candlesticks on the chart became shorter and i observed some kind of price decay 
at the same time i see the sarcastics are in the upper zone so from this i understand that the market is in the overbought at the moment so here i'm going to open a trade for a minute on the downside i think that the price will make a pull back down and resume its growth at the same time i can see that the price has already made quite a strong pull back down earlier it shows that the price has the potential to go down also in this situation i've taken the time of one minute taking into account that such a trade is against the trend and that it's against the main upward price movement let me wait for the results is not bad at all you can see the price shows a slight decrease that's my deal closes below the entry point and i got quite a good profit so i'm going to continue and find my next entry point so i can see the price makes a good pull back downwards and without hitting the support level it starts to go upwards at the same time the stochastics are in the upper zone and the yellow line crosses the blue line in this situation i'm going to open a two minute uptrade as the indicator tells me that the price has a good upside potential also, I still have a lot of room up to the last price high. In this case, after a pullback down near the support level, you can see there was a reaction. And last time the price having touched this level, that showed a good growth. So it's more likely that in the near future, the price will continue to move upward on the uptrend. Also here, I'm taking two minutes with the reserve, taking into account that the price may get into the haggling zone or there'll be a pullback down. But let me watch this chart and see what happens in the next few minutes. This is excellent. You can see the price is moving according to my scenario and showing a good growth. And here I'm getting a confident plus. The indicator really gave me a great entry point and two minutes was just perfect for me here. Meanwhile, I already have $6,000 as my deposit. My trading goal for today is fulfilled and I'll stop here. So as you saw, all the situations today were quite interesting and quite good. I found very good entry points today on the market and hit my goal. So combining technical analysis with the sarcastic oscillator works great so i advise you to also do the same thing in order to also gain experience practice a lot and be able to make very good profit in no time if you have any questions concerning today's trade i'm ready and willing to answer all your questions ask them down below in the comment section or in my private chat and don't forget to like this video don't forget to share this video to your friends and family and subscribe down below to my channel and also don't forget to hit the notification bell so until next time bye bye